excited to be filming this video because I've been working on this for a minute and a bit. So basically, I hit 5,000 subscribers like several, several weeks ago and we didn't celebrate, we didn't do anything, but I didn't forget basically. I wanted to give you guys a giveaway that was just as good as the last one and that's why I've partnered with a brand called Yod to give one of my lucky subscribers one of their luxury Yod watches, kind of like mine, yes, yes, yes. So we are not going to be disappointing and I wish all of you guys the best of luck. Make sure if you're a minx and make sure if you've been subscribed and supporting me for a minute, you enter this competition because I want one of you guys to walk away with a Yod watch. So guys, basically what Yod have done is they've sent me six questions that they want me to answer for you guys and they're pretty interesting questions. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you stay tuned to the end, it's going to be a short video and all the information you need to enter this competition will be in my description box below as well as the link to the contest page. Basically all you have to do to enter is click the link and fill in all your details and you'll be in with a chance to win. So guys, let's get cracking. I'm going to answer the questions that you have sent me. So first of all, have you ever bought a watch for a guy before? Um, no. <laughs> Simply put, no, not really. Because I feel like when you give your partner jewellery, you're basically saying like, I love you. Jewellery means I love you. It means like, this is serious, like this is deep. And I don't think I've ever been in that kind of situation where I wanted to be like, yeah like we ride or die <laughs> like, so I've never given a partner a watch before but I have given my dad a watch so like when my dad turned 60 I got him a Gucci watch and I had it inscribed on the back just something really timeless I feel like watches are very timeless gifts you know and it really does say I love you so like I felt like that was an amazing present um but yeah only for my dad so far but hopefully one day question number two how many watches do you own? Um, I'm definitely a watchie, so I've got quite a collection. I've bought a lot of watches in my time, let's see. So other than my dad's watch, um, I also got another Gucci watch that I got for myself. Idiot that I am, I lost it when I was on a holiday in Greece and that really hurt my soul because I loved that watch. Um, but I've also bought four Michael Kors watches as well. I end up giving one to my sister, but I still have three of my Michael Kors. I will never buy a Michael Kors watch again. Like I still like the ones that I have, but I kind of feel like they're a bit played out. Like everybody got one. Like the whole Michael Kors watch thing for me is dead. I'll never buy another one. And of course, I've got my new Yode watch, which I absolutely love. I definitely prefer this watch to any of my Michael Kors. For me, this is kind of like on the same level as my Gucci watch, which I just was obsessed with. It hurt my soul when I lost that watch. But yeah, you made up for it. <laughs> Question number three, what's the most important feature in a watch for you? Okay guys, so I'm not fancy. I don't know anything really about watches. So what I'm looking for when I buy a watch is something that's gonna make me look rich. Something that's gonna make me look expensive. Something that's gonna be like, Yes, we have arrived. Like I need to look five times richer than I actually am <laughs> when I buy like a watch. When I invest that coin, I want to return on my investment. I want to look like I'm balling. I want to be stunning for the gram and quality. So make me look rich and be good quality. Question number four: What you watch did you choose and why? Okay, guys. So yeah, take a look. Take a look. Hey. <laughs> So I chose the ebony and iron just because I love that whole all black everything kind of vibe. It's very simple. It doesn't have a lot of bling around it. And yeah, it's very elegant. Like you can't fault this watch. It looks fantastic. Question number five. What about a guy's appearance stands out to you? Um, there's a few things that stand out to me. Firstly, I'd probably say a smile, like a good smile definitely stands out. And good hair and good grooming definitely stands out. But when it comes to a guy's appearance, like it's really does he take pride in the way he looks. Like I'm someone that cares a lot about the way I look and I put a lot of effort. So I want a guy 
who takes pride in the way he looks and there are two things that I mainly look at when I'm thinking mm, you know does he have it does he have the swag first of all are his shoes like did he walk up in here with some busted shoes if it's a yes then it's a no it's a hell no it's a no not today like i need a guy to have nice clean shoes and also a guy's watch if a guy doesn't have a watch i'm like i don't understand what you're trying to say i'm not speaking your language you know i feel like you can tell a guy if a guy's put together if he's a bit like you know sophisticated a bit suave by the kind of watch a guy wears did he invest the more money did he put that coin aside to get himself a good watch yeah you can definitely tell a lot about a guy from his shoes and from his watch question number six and this is the last question if you were to buy your partner a yoed watch which would you choose and why um okay we ain't got a bay so <laughs> there's no partner to buy a yoed watch but if i was gonna buy one um i would definitely go for the ebony and copper just because i kind of like that whole bay goals couple goals like we're in this together kind of couple swag so i feel like the ebony and copper would really complement my ebony and iron and it's got that kind of like black vibe to it that's what i go for we could be doing like hashtag big girls couple girls more about jazz i don't know <laughs> but i think it's kind of cute when couples do that so yeah that's probably the one that i would go for so once again thank you so much to yo for sponsoring this video for partnering with me and for giving one of you guys the opportunity to win one of their luxury watches make sure you go to my description box below and click on the link to enter the contest fill in your details and one of you guys will win how it's going to work is you're going to get and get 180 dollar discount code as well as 25 percent off a watch of your choice and there's also going to be a second winner who's going to get a 50 dollar discount code as well as 25 dollars off 25 percent off a watch of your choice just so you know my ebony and iron watch was 220 dollars so if you are the first winner you can basically get this watch for free ain't gonna spend no coin that's your christmas present that's Bay's christmas present you're sorted and for everybody else who doesn't win but still enters the competition you guys are all gonna get 25 percent discount automatically so you can go ahead and get daddy a present you can get Bay a present you can get yourself a present like yeah you're gonna save some major coin this Christmas. So I love you guys. We are looking good. We are feeling good. I hope you guys love the Yoda watches as much as I love them. I'm going to flash some of my favorite ones up on the screen. Check them out on Instagram and use the hashtag Yoda watches, guys. By the way, guys, if you want me to do Vlogmas this year, some people have been reaching out and saying do Vlogmas. If you want me to do Vlogmas, comment below let me know do you guys really want to see me filming videos dropping videos every single day in december you're gonna to have to let me know because if you guys don't comment i'm not gonna do it will you watch if i film a video every single day let me know don't forget to subscribe because we are not giving out free watches y'all you need to be a subscriber you need to be a mix so guys i love you and i'll see you guys soon looking good